sit. Okay, sit. Well, it's a pretty sad day today at the farm, in the household. I had to put our dog down today. Lucy was a purebred Rottweiler. Um, this was my third Rottie that I've had. And uh, it doesn't get easier, I guess. It's something about animals, right? I mean, people will ball, ball their eyes out for the animals, more, sometimes more than humans. Um, you know, she, she was a good dog. You know, she had some sort of uh, like a thyroid thing, but it, it closed her mouth uh, and like indented her forehead and she really couldn't eat. Um, she was going pretty good for a little while. Unfortunately, the last couple of nights, um, you know, she started throwing up and it, she couldn't really throw up and you could tell it was just all like, it wasn't good. So, um, you know, my wife's a trooper. She took, she took her. Um, and they put her down. You know, the hardest part about it is really the kids, in my opinion. Um, you know, Harper had a hard time um, saying goodbye. And uh, rightfully so, right? I mean, Harper's known that dog for forever. And uh, she was a good dog. She started to, you know, understand the farm and loved being outside. And But every single time she would start running and stuff, she just, she just couldn't, she would just keep throwing up. So, um, you know, the right decision is to put the dog down at that point um, rather than let him suffer. And I know people have their, their, their ways on what they do and keeping dogs alive. And, uh, you know, but when you're keeping a dog alive for you, and not for the, the well-being of the dog, then, you know, in my opinion, it's time to put the dog down. Um, so, doesn't get any easier putting any animal down. Um, doesn't get any easier. But I figured I'd make a little video uh, of just kind of what uh, Lucy's done um, with our lives and, you know, how she's touched our lives. And some of the little quirks that she had as a Roddy um, were really something. Um, she did have her mind of her own, which most Roddies do. And... <laughs> <laughs> she's gonna be missed she's gonna be missed and uh we, we loved her very much and um she's definitely in a better place and she's up there running with uh gracie who's my first roddy um an angel another roddy and we had another dog that died really young oliver um so I'm sure she's up there running around um with them so it was pretty sad but anyway you're gonna be you'll be missed lucy for sure but i'll tell you she definitely had a mind of her own she loved being outside, loved being with the animals. She really, really was a good um, guard dog with my kids. Very protective of the kids. Um, just kind of knew her role. Something about Binks. She loved Binks. <laughs> oh, it was funny. She loved watching the animals out the window. She's a good dog. Hi.